had the opportunity to work on now two books uh, from bloggers. One uh, is Demetrius book, uh, who my boss acquired, and then I acquired uh, a book titled Swirling, How to Date, Mate, and Relate with Mixing Race, Culture, and Creed, um, who was uh, written by two journalists. One blogs on beyondblackwhite.com. And uh, I guess the, what we would look for is, what I'm, I'm looking for particularly is uh, that the book is part of a bigger brand. So essentially, your book is just a piece of some larger marketing and media effort that you have going on, and the book is just like this component because essentially, Atria is a commercial publisher, and we need to know that we can sell this book, and the book can sell itself essentially, um, and you can sell your book too. So we kind of look for that 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 edge. If, if the author has um, a nice, sizable Twitter and Facebook following, what's that's nice sizable? <laughs> That's a great question. It's it's totally arbitrary, um, <laughs> totally arbitrary. But uh, I mean, yeah, like a thousand. We can start there, which you know isn't that much, but it's like that's a lot, you know. And then if you have the promise that your 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 following can can build, um, that also helps too, um, because the authors are swirling. Didn't necessarily have a huge Twitter following, but I knew they were they were working towards something, and now it's probably like doubled or tripled since the book has come out. Between the year that I acquired the book and now the book has come out, their their exposure has gone up tremendously. So we you know we look for that, or if you have the potential of a, of a, a nice sizable um, social network following, we definitely want to consider that. Um, so so yeah so yeah you know having a nice branded package for your book is. Important. And have a good message too. The message needs to be relatable. Okay, and when you say a branded package, is that a book proposal? It's 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 what you're doing. So um, so for swirling, this is uh, my sort of case study here. Uh, it's they had a message, they had a website, um, they had an idea of what the book package would look like. This ice cream cone the swirl thing. It's like Swirling was this uh, new sort of term that was made as popular essentially from blogs, and um, it <laughs> resonates with people. And I knew I could sell this as an idea that um, if swirling the, the the term makes it big, the book has the potential to also make it big. So I could attach it to this sort of larger package. So everything sort of fits the the author's goal and message, the book package. Um, social networks, all a part of this effort that you put together and the book is essentially a part of it. Demetria, what did you do to get ready to make the transition into a public book um, <clears throat> I, I didn't really think about for a very long time about getting a book deal. Um, like I had a blog and I was writing and I knew it was very popular. Um, but I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do with it. My readers are the ones who kept saying, like, you should write a book, you should write a book, you should write a book. So eventually I was like, oh, I guess I should like, write a book. <laughs> um, but I realized, um, I come from a book publishing background as well. Like I worked um, at BUT and Harlequin for five years before um, going to Essence. Um, so I sort of knew what editors were looking for in terms of books. Like you could submit like a really great book, and if you didn't have a way to market it, then you weren't gonna buy it. Like we were all about like what is your platform, just like Todd said, like what is your sort of social media following. Um, so at the time that I got my book deal, my blog was you know doing extraordinarily well. Um, I just landed a column at Essence. I landed a show on VH1, um, and I was working or appearance on a show on VH1, and I was working on a Washington Post profile. And so I was just like, I think I got a platform now. <laughs> so um, I called up Malika because she's been my mentor from back in my book publishing days. Um, and I put together like this really fancy proposal, like you know that everybody used to send to me, and it takes so long, but it was such a long proposal. And I put it together, and you know everything was really like nice and beautiful. And she picked it up and she flipped through it, and then she just put it aside. And I was like, what are you, what are you doing? Um, and then so we just talked for sort of like two hours and change, um, and then she was like, all right, like you know, well, when you get a draft of your book done, you know, send it in. And I was like, oh, okay. Um, and then after that, things like moved pretty quickly. Like I literally turned the proposal in, and then maybe. I think like a month, almost a month later, she um, she called to say they were going to make me an offer.
za tvoji